We are live. I hope you like the lo-fi, lo what? Lo-fi music I've got. I just need to set the references up. And then... Oh, that's annoying. There we are, everything's set up, now let's go to my live stream, check audio, and then we should be good. One, two, ow, that hurt a little bit. Yeah, I can hear everything, we should be good. There we go. Uh, first I'm gonna work on the mountains. So today's prompt is fuzzy. So I saw this like really cool art piece and like, there were like, like worm things and I wanted to like adapt it to my own type of like art style and I added and I just made it a bit different so yeah that was a really cool reference I found and yeah they were just like fuzzy creatures that like I'm drawing here so I thought that was a cool idea so I decided let's do it so I'm, I'm just drawing in some base mountains to have drawn. So I've got this reference of like some guy like on like a mountain like oh yeah I like this well. Like all those like traveler photos. They're actually pretty useful for drawing. Hope that looks cool. I love um, drawings like this. I want to turn the music down a bit though because it's a bit loud. There we are. Uh, a bit quiet, honestly. It's just a bit loud for me. And then I want to turn the desktop audio up so you can, you guys can still hear it without it not being able to be heard. And just start listening to like lo-fi hip-hop and stuff more on just on my own because I, most, I mostly just listen to it for twitch Some, I, I need to make sure like the rocks and stuff in this mountain are like seeable I guess like the the details of this mountain are actually viewable since this is the this is like the mountain the dude's on so it's like the, it's a foreground mountain that is 
So I'm gonna try and make it viewable. And then the rest of them can just be that have this like, um, like less seeable type feature. So like, it's just like in the background. This might be the best drawing I do for Inktober because it's probably the best I, the best like drawing idea, I guess. Alright, we're done the sketch. Um, no, not we're not done the sketch. I mean, uh, I need to add a bit here real quick. But I was saying like we're, we're like done the mountains, but um, we're not even done that. <laughs> I want to add some like details, rock face and stuff. Should hold. What, what, um, I don't want it to be first. Uh, let's draw the little character here on the top of the mountain. Um, he's gonna have like his little traveler backpack on. He's just like a blob guy that I decided decided to make. Uh, he's just got all, all his all his body. He's just like a blob. Pretty easy to draw. When I can't be bothered drawing like, like full human anatomy and stuff on characters, especially when they're like really small characters, I'm drawing like some like fantasy art and stuff. It's just like really small. There's no point um, like giving him full anatomy and just like spending time on that when it's like barely gonna be seen. So I've just decided to make him a little blob. And also by learning anatomy, I can just like make him a blob and know how to do it, you know? I know where everything goes. I don't really need, um, I don't need stuff anymore to have that know where everything goes. So yeah, it's pretty good. There we are, there's this little backpack he's got. Then I'm, I'm gonna give him like a cap. And he's found it. We should have some shoes too, actually. Let's make sure he's got some shoes. There we go. Now he's, now the little character man, he's all done. Now I need to draw the massive fuzzy Creature, dude. I love this character. It's really cool. Alright, I want him to be like up close to him. So, like, maybe here will be good. Yep, that's good. That's like the little sketch of the head I've done. I want to make like all the blobs like interacting with the little dude as much as possible. They're like friendly creatures, kind of. It's unsure, it's un undetermined <laughs> at this point. 
they're like little fuzzy actually they're massive maybe they're maybe maybe the dudes are small huh? and they're just like normal worms <laughs> no 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 um all right so i got the base for him down now let's do his eyes inspired by those like fish um those fish with really massive eyes That look really dumb, but it's funny. So, yeah. All right, let's make him looking at him. I'm just gonna fill him in, and then I can use the white ink that I got as um. The pupil, or the whatever it's called, on the little white highlight. I'm, I'm not copying the sketch that I have up there um, exactly, so it might be a bit different than you see up there. Got him done pretty much. Just need to, uh, yep. uh, you can see more more of his head in this one. I think I prefer it. being able to see more of his forehead. <laughs> I need to draw like the little curvy lines he's got here to show like the bend in his body. Uh, there's his little fuzzy lines. All right. So, is he done? What else could I add to make him a bit different than normal? And yeah, that's about it. Looks cool. Alright, what's next? What's the next um, character I can do? Alright, I got this like blob reference of just like a, you know, one of those, uh, those like stretch ball things with the, I don't know, a line. They've got like little fuzz. They, they, I don't know. Kind of just look like blobs. Um, I got a reference of one of those, but with eyes. So that's what I'm gonna draw as that guy right there. This is probably gonna be a longer stream, isn't it? Because of this psycho like, big idea I've got down. I 
That's cool. I like longer streams sometimes, but then sometimes I hate them. Like a lot. But this this is gonna be a good drawing. Oh, you know it would be cool if his arm was like um touching the dude. Like if he was like something like Yeah. Like as if he was gonna push him off. <laughs> in a in a joking way though. No, 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 in a, not in a real way. If these guys aren't monsters or anything, these guys aren't gonna kill him. That's not their plan at all. Right now I need to draw this like finger guy, which is like, he's literally just a finger, but fuzzy. Oh wait, I forgot to draw the, this guy's eyes and stuff. Right, let me get the fish eye reference. They all got the same face. As for like the fish eye, the big fish eye that is. I love the fish with the really big eyes, they're cool. But they look really dumb, so. Yeah. trying to make them look as like, cute as possible as well as um as terrifying as possible at the same time so like the i think just the size and also their teeth just add the fear factor to it like obviously in the drawing it's not scary to look at but um as for like if you were the character You can kind of understand how that would be a tiny bit scary. As for the size factor. As for like the arms and stuff, I think I might just leave them. Like for this cat creature. They're not going to be fuzzy. I know the prompt was fuzzy, and that's the whole point, but, you know. Now this guy, he's pretty easy to draw, because if you know how to draw one single finger, as if it was like poking out like this, uh, how can I go, yeah, like that. That's a perfect reference, so yeah, I might use that. I got, I got it right here, actually. So, one comes out like that, two, like that, three, like that, and four, like that, and then five, I'm numbering them because it makes it easier to draw in my head, it may have worked for me, for some reason. Now that's the finger. 
if you want to argue if that actually looks like a thing it would be. Um, no open invitations allowed. So you're not invited. Invited to what? No idea. Um, Now this guy's just got, oh no, I went out of focus, <laughs> no, please, 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 go back into focus. I hate, I hate when it does this. Do we have to just sit through it? Let's go like that, and then go out. Let's just draw, and see what happens. It always does this, it should come back soon. This guy's just got one big guy on the side of his face. There we are. Perfect. For now. <laughs> this is upsetting. Now let's add some fuzz to him. This guy's like a bit of a smaller worm, I think. I don't know. They've got sizes to them. This guy's one of the smaller ones, I think. Alright, they're all fuzzy though. That's the best part about them. The fuzziness. Right. Done. Sketch. I'm gonna leave the sketch, okay? That's a sketch done. No more. No more. So, what's next? Should I ink? Like with this? Just do a nice cool inking. Or should I use like a brush pen? Like this? I'm gonna... This is nearly out, but I'm gonna use it. I hate inking with this already. Like, I used to love it because, um, like, the ink quality and stuff, but now, since it's out of ink, basically, it's terrible to work with. Let's use the Faber Castell one. This one's also nearly out of ink, I'm pretty sure. But we're giving it a go. Let's look at the eye reference, so there is a bit of a sack down the eye afterwards. This makes it a bit more creepier, which is good. That is the point, it's supposed to be creepy, yet kind of cute at the same time. Whatever you take from it. If you think it's cute, good for you. If you think it's terrifying, that's amazing. I don't know what I want it to be. I'll just say what it is. In the end, and that's what I want it to be.
Oh no, that ink didn't really come out well. Yeah, that should be better. Yep. This wasn't the best idea to do. First, maybe it was, I don't know. Maybe it was actually the best idea to do. Maybe I'm a genius for doing this first. Maybe I just solved every world issue with this. Uh, so there's worm one done. It looks rather poggers. Some textures for the lips, it's fine. Going like this. That's cool. That guy's cool. And it's as it add his little fuzz there. Here we go, there's his little fuzz. Then he's um very um non fuzzy arms. Big arm. Yeah, it looks like he's gonna push him on it. He's gonna push him. Yeah. <laughs> he's gonna die. <laughs> Imagine. It's so funny. I imagine the story of this is like these guys live here and this like traveler dude's just like chilling. It's like, hey guys, I climbed your mountain. And now these guys are like, oh yeah. Did you really? And then, like, push them all. Uh, I did a little bit up there, and I need to cover it up. That's pretty easy. Covered it up.
I honestly think the um the the mountains in the background we should just go very um very what do you call it, expressive with them. So I'm gonna use a Copic marker. And just very be very um loose. I forgot to do the shoes. That's pretty easy. Easy fix from Fine Miner. There we go, that's cool. Alright, um, I'm gonna draw the dude, and then I'm gonna do the clouds. The finger dude! The fuzzy finger man! Little finger dude. Uh, yeah, they're so fuzzy. They're all so fuzzy. What are we going to do? They are also fuzzy creatures. Gonna love the fuzzy creatures. I'm adding all their fuzz. Gonna love the fuzz. There's some fuzz. If you don't love the fuzz, get out of the fuzz. I don't even know what that means. Deal with it. <laughs> I mean something like that, I'm pretty sure. Get out of the fuzz. It's a fuzz for this. I don't even know what that means. I'm just gonna go with it. There's a fuzz finger. Fuzz finger man. Expressive of these clouds. Clouds are very expressive. Let's go on. Yep, there's the clouds. 
Alright, now I want to go over everything in this. Let's get the small one. Let's do the, let's use the bigger one for this. This job is uh, for the bigger one, I'm pretty sure. Could I like to use a bit of this? Could I just go? Could I just go with this? And then... Yeah, that works. I'm gonna just use this to go over everything. All the areas like this, I'm gonna go over in this. There we are, Those, that's all the areas there are of that, so don't need that anymore. Give it a bit of a dip, make sure it's watered down. What color is, gonna, is the creatures gonna be? I don't know. All I know is the night sky is gonna be. It's not. It's not a night sky, but it's like a darker sky. So let's do the sky first. I wouldn't consider it night at this point, but I would consider it late afternoon. Alright. Boom. I want to make sure this is one of the most poggers drawings that I do. I'm gonna do it no matter what. No matter what challenges face me. <laughs> How long have we? 38 minutes. That's a. Last time I checked, it was only 15. Now, that went fast, actually. It's already 6.14. I don't, wanna... I don't like rushing, but sometimes I want get, to get it done. You know, <laughs> you know what I'm saying. Sometimes you just want to get it done. And then go home, even though I am at home. It's just not the same. Oh, I hope I'm not too tired, like when I'm posting this and stuff. Because I am very tired right now. If you were wondering, if you were asked. I don't think you did though. Right, let's go with that, and then let's water it down completely. Make sure it's watered down, and then go like that. I like how I watered this down completely, yet it's still darker than the sky. This is like the background, so it doesn't matter if it gets on the worms a tiny bit. Can be like highlighting or whatever. <laughs> Shading. I'm gonna do the, all the background first. So, yeah. And yeah, I mean, all in the background. See, that's not gonna do it. That's not gonna show up, I don't think so. Let's get a bit of black. Bit of that, and then go. Then let it spread. 
Well, I already created a spell. This spell is I want to darken this up a tiny bit. Then we can have some dark mountains for the front. Let's make sure it's completely dark. Front mountains have to be the darkest. And then you want some more. There we are, it's completely dark. I think I might just leave the worms and the character normal except for shading. That's all I'm gonna do to them. That'll be cool. I think that'll make them pop out the most. They already pop out now, but I feel like it's just not realistic enough to like pop out, I don't know. They still pop out, it's just not in a realistic way. So I wanna change that. That's for sure gonna make him pop out. <laughs> Just the, the pure darkness of that ink that I've got. I wanna make all of them pop out. So we got, yeah, we can see all the mountains, we can see where they end, kind of, I guess, um, yeah, so that's good, captured that, um, what's next, what's next, the characters, the little blob dudes, the fuzzy, the fuzzy worms, I love the fuzzy worms, they're the best. And then I want to like hide, like show the shadows below. And then let's capture the top. Get the thing shaded in.
Now it's starting to look like blood on them. <laughs> the shading. Uh, no, not blood. Never. If I had some patches of it, that would be cool. That would definitely look like blood. Now, do I want to do that? Do I want them to be terrifying creatures that are going to kill this dude? Or not? I don't know. Not, I don't, I'm undecided. I'm decided if you are going to die yet, dude. Do not worry, your death is in my hands. Alright. Let's look at the reference real quick. Just had some splotches. Alright, I need some ink for that though. Let's make it a darker ink. Let's just like add some like random splotches. Of this ink somewhere. The teeth are the best options. I'm gonna do it a bit on his feet. <laughs> Let's add some on this dude. Maybe I can be killing friends. Just. <laughs> That makes him look cool. <laughs> Not blood, I, I, it's just a spill. <laughs> maybe, maybe I should have that as the title. It's not blood, it's just a spill. I swear. <laughs> Best title. His blood like pouring out of his mouth. Uh, that's cool. So I've got all that down. Now let's do the highlights. This is a very long stream. fast because this is already a long stream uh, one eye highlight two eye highlight one 
one I highlight. Two I highlight. One I highlight. And he doesn't get a second one. He's not special enough for one. <laughs> Then we're just going to add some highlights on the bits that aren't shaded. No arms it goes. That's how it works. When I look at this, does it give me the sense of what I'm going for? Fuzzy. Fuzzy. That's all I'm going for. They are fuzzy creatures. And it looks good. So I was going for good. Number one, good. Number two, fuzzy. Number one, fuzzy. Number two, good. Hmm. I think it's pretty good. Let's go with it. Second I drop this in, it's over. It's over. I've done it. Almost an hour of drawing for this one. Last time I spent more on drawing, last time I spent a bit more, um, it was the rope, like the rope, or like the knot one, yeah, the knot one. <laughs> that didn't end up good. So thanks for watching this VOD or stream or whatever you're watching it on. Um, this was the, this drawing. Um, it is fuzzy. Um, I'm happy with this drawing. It does, it, it serves its purpose. Um, it's fuzzy and it's good. Um, so thanks for watching and peace.